This is WNBC FM New York, 97.1. Well, it won't be long now. It's the eve of the liftoff of Apollo 15's 12-day moon mission, which the entire world will follow. But what happens with America's space program after the Apollo series ends? For a report, here's Monitor reporter Paul Mason in Philadelphia. Chairman Olin Teague of the House Subcommittee on Manned Space Flight is concerned over the coming cutback on manned space flight by the United States. With the attention on the current Apollo shot, Chairman Teague, a Texas Democrat, thinks that the United States may be making a serious mistake in reducing manned space flights for the future after the Apollo series. Behind the scenes, as he attended a convention here in Philadelphia, Chairman Teague discussed with Monitor the present U.S. position in space as it involves jobs, security, and the current space race with the Soviet Union. Well, Paul, I think in many ways we are behind in the space race. For example, the recent uh, operation of the Russians where they lost three men, uh, that was a space station that we're two, three years away from, which we call our Skylab program. And uh, the uh, shuttle program, which we have $100 million in the budget this year to get it started. But it will, that's just the beginning phase. When we get into production, it sh our budget should go up to about $5 billion. And my information is that the administration said they're not going to go to that level. If they don't, I think we're going to make a big mistake. Do you feel that we're going to do